Hey guys, Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. So today, got another coin we're going to look into mining. It's not really speculative um, mining on this one. It's been out for a while. Um, it's going to be Energy Coin. Uh, we'll see what it's about and how to mine it. See you in a bit. All right, so Energy Coin. Here we are right here. It's been out for a while. Um, I think about mid next year or mid last year. Let me look at the Bitcoin talk real quick. Yeah, mid last year, August 2017. So it's been around for a while. Uh, what about six, seven months, somewhere around in there. Uh, our mission being the world's leading cryptocurrency with the unification of smart contracts, governance, and self-funding treasury to ensure longevity and enable rapid growth. Got a little video you can watch. Um, how energy sets itself apart. The majority of cryptocurrencies today have a system of mining in place which rewards those running their graphics cards or CPUs or specialized mining hardware, ASICs. Uh, this functions as inflation or could even be seen as a type of tax on cryptocurrency. Bitcoin at 100 billion market cap is burning over $5 billion a year on mining, uh, would be electricity costs. Uh, Bitcoin had a system in place similar to energy. Bitcoin would currently have billions of dollars worth per year to allocate to development and growth. This is an enormous misvalue, a gap which energy seeks to fill. So, they got a nice team, pretty decent story. I'm not going to go through all of these videos they got um, and things of that nature. I'll put the link down below. Here's a roadmap and everything else. So you guys can go and check that out along with the Bitcoin talk here. Um, so what we're going to need to do first is get a wallet for it. So if we head back over to their site, Get Energy Wallets, and you can scroll down just a bit and you click right here, Downloads Page. Of course, the link for this will be right down below, so you won't have to worry about going to their site and doing this. So of course I downloaded the Energy Core Windows 64 because that's what I have. And we'll hop over on my AMD rig, which is what I got it mining uh, on right now, and we'll see what it looks like. All right, so here is my AMD rig. I have this running on here right now. So once you click this link right here, let me scoot this over right here, and let me pull up my wallets folder. You'll get a little link that, um, actually I put it in, there it is, energy right here. You'll get this little link right here, or a little file, set up a uh, .exec file. Double click on that, follow the prompts, and then you'll get this file here. And um, I just put them both in the same folder. It'll put them under the uh, app data roaming folder, but I just like it having it all in one place. So anyways, this is what you'll get. And let me pull up the actual wallet here. This is what the wallet looks like. We still look like we're about 16 weeks behind. So it's been um, updating here for a bit. Probably about, I think it's been about an hour and a half now I've been on it. Um, at least had the wallet open and running. So anyways, you can either click on receive and create your own mining address like here. Like, um, like just call it mining.amd like I did right here. Click show and then you'll get your address right there and you can just click copy address or you can go over to file click receiving addresses and there's the default one they'll give you or like I said you can create your own that's up to you so of course we're gonna need the wallet um, wallet address right here for our miner and speaking of miners I'm gonna go over here energy has its own miner so energy miner v2.2.1 so of course I downloaded the Windows version right here go back over to my let me close this real quick go back over to my AMD rig sorry it's a little laggy alright so I downloaded mine unzipped it and called it energy miner if you go into here then go into bin. I created a run, my own run.bat file. It took me a little bit to figure it out because it's not really like uh, other miners. And uh, that'll save you guys a lot of time. It took me probably 30, 45 minutes to figure it out. 
But anyways, if you go to edit, this is what your run.back file will look like. Again, this is below. All you got to do is copy what's below and change your wallet address, which is right here, to yours. Um, your rig identifier, which is right there, including the period. If not, you can leave that blank. Um, I just call mine, of course, AMD rig. So your wallet address dot whatever your rig name is. And then, of course, here is the pool I'm using. Uh, right there. And if you want to change pools, that's up to you. Let me see. I think here's some pools right here. Zerg pool is another one. But um, I'm using this one right here. But you can use whatever pool you want, or you can just jump on the same one I'm on. So again, that's all you would need to change. Wallet address, rig identifier is optional, and of course your pool. Also, this um, miner, you can use AMD or NVIDIA with it. So to differentiate, you see this little dash G right here? That's for AMD. So if you're mining with AMD, just leave that alone. Copy this bat file and save it. Uh, if you're mining with NVIDIA, that G, you would backspace that, and it would be U simple as that so again that's also uh, I tell you how to do that below with this video as well and of course all you do is click file you know save as save that notepad as um run you can name it whatever you want just make sure it's a .bat I'll name mine for the purposes of this video run to .bat click save close out of that and you can see there's a run.2 file. So the miner, it's not a very uh, aesthetically pleasing miner, I guess they would call it. It's pretty bare bones, just looks like a command line um, type deal. And it's kind of hard to read and see what's going on, but the way you tell if it's actually working, of course, is you go over to the pool, which is right here. Um, this is the energy mining pool that I'm using. And you go in to log in, like you click on log in, like other log in, and all you gotta do is enter your wallet address. Mine's already pre populated. Click log in, and it will show you your minor statistics. You got 110 mega hash right now going. You can scroll down, see other statistics. This is all I've made so far. Again, it's only been on there an hour. Some of these things are delayed. It took a little bit for it to show up on the pool. Um, let me see earnings. Yeah, so 0 0.038, been on in about an hour. Um, again, this is kind of speculative. According to what to mine, if I scroll down from my AMD rig, it's saying it should be a little bit better than Ethereum Classic right now. So I guess um, I'll give it about 24 hours and I'll wait and see. So yeah, after 24 hours, I'll revisit it and see how it's, um, see how it's going. So if you want, I'll stop this real quick, and I uh, will show you what it looks like when it actually pulls up. It's very basic, nothing fancy. And this is what it'll do. It'll find out what cards you got. So you can see zero through five right there real quick. It'll set the DAG and the kernels on them, and uh, takes a little bit, maybe about a minute or so, and then it'll come up. Um, and tell you the mega hash of each of them. There we go. Speed zero right now until it's setting the uh, the buffers on each of the GPUs, and then it'll be uh, then should be good to go. Let me let it spool up here a little bit and see what I get. 52 mega hash right now. Still hasn't done the RX um, 560s yet. A couple of them now. 84. But you guys get the point. There we are. All the way up. 111 mega hash. So that's um, that's uh, energy coin, guys. Easy as it is to mine. Again, I will um, give you guys a recap tomorrow on the profitability of it. Uh, price of it right now is about eighty cents, as you can see here. It's been as high as like a dollar thirty something, I think. Yeah, dollar thirty four in that range. So it looks like a decent project. It's been around for a while. <laughs> A uh, quick update on the BOPU coin. I was able to get 1,873 of those coins. As you can see, I did drop off of it right there. 
13 miners on it uh, as of right now. When I started the video yesterday, oh, somebody just jumped on it, 14. When I started the video yesterday, it was five, you know, including me. It went all the way up to 21, and um, after the video, I don't know if that was because I did a video on it or what, but anyways, the uh, profit or the difficulty shot up, and I wasn't getting as many coins, so 1873 is fine for me right now on this highly speculative coin, so I'm good with that, and I'll just leave it the way it is um, on that one. Okay, guys. It's going to be it. If you guys have any questions or comments, please put them down below. I'll be sure to get back to you. Again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. If you like that video, hit the thumbs up. And with that, guys, um, I will see you in the next one. Take care.